Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Aosteezy back at again. Let me just make sure my camera's all good. Let me just kind of crouch here a little bit. We good. Um, like I said, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Aosteezy back at again. I got a kind of different type of video again for you guys. I'm only doing this because this happened last night and it's super recent. I just wanted to discuss it because, like, I, like I was streaming when this happened and, like, I told the guy I was in my stream. He's a mod. Shout out to my man, Dragon. But, um, as I was saying, like... The Call of Duty community is so toxic, and like the, I got into a party after I stopped streaming. I was just talking with my friends, and we we're trying to discuss what the most toxic gaming community is. And like for me personally, I feel like it's Call of Duty. Just like, cause like I made a video about this before, like in World War Two around Christmas time, we had Christmas noobs saying the N word, saying racial slurs. I don't want to like say what they actually. Well, of course I'm not gonna say what they actually said, but they're anyway. They're saying racial slurs. They were just doing, like, they're just trolling, I don't know if they're making a video, or if they actually, like, if that was their views, then they're, they need to get their head checked out, like, the things they were saying were atrocious, and definitely not acceptable to anyone, to, like, for anyone, whoever says whatever they said, but, um, I'm just gonna show you some messages, just some trash talk, and I don't mean to expose anyone, like, that in my messages and in, every, in everything, I just, like, I could block out their names, but I don't really want to edit, so I'm not going to, and there's cuss words in here, so... I don't want to, like I said, I don't want to expose anyone. I don't want you guys to message them or anything. And I know usually only my friends watch my videos anyway. But I just don't want any hate or anything on them. I just want to try to improve the community the best I can. So, every time I stream, if you've ever been in my stream, it might be a little laggy. Or recently, I've had to bump the quality down to 720 because I'm super laggy when I stream. So, I get lots of messages. People ask it like, this one. Like, everyone always discusses my connection. Like, you won because your connection is trash. And then you have this guy who asked if I was European. No, I'm North American. But, like, see, I'll snipe, you're lagging. And then, yeah. There's those. Like, I just, there's been so many messages recently just because I've been streaming a lot more about my connection. And then last night there was this guy. And we're just playing public matches. Like, I wasn't playing 1v1s or anything. We were li literally just playing public matches. So, he said, fix your net, you leggy cuss word. I said, streaming, I can't afford better. Sorry. And I honestly can't. Like, I, I've been trying to get better internet, but it's been a struggle lately. Anyway, besides the point. So, he said, stop, you suck, broke, but don't stream. I said, I'm good, thanks. He said, don't bother, you have zero viewers and are butt at the game and straight legging soft AF. Then he said, bro, you got ripped so many times, nobody would ever watch you stream. First of all, I went 40 and 20 that game. I had more kills than him and less amount of deaths. My kill death ratio was better. Yes, his team ended up winning the game, but because there was five of them in a party, I was playing by myself with randoms, and they weren't the best randoms. I was the best of my team. But um, anyway, besides the point, so I'm just saying I wasn't getting ripped. Anyway, so... Yeah, absolute garbage. It's free headshots. They they did have really good shots. I I will give them that. They were good at Call of Duty, but it's their attitude that I don't support at all. Anyway, I, and then I got kind of pissed off. I said I did better than you? Question mark. It's leggy for me too. So if I had good internet, I'd drop eighty. A fact. Yeah, right. You never drop eighty, even if it's on eighty year olds. You did better. You lost the game. You ate freaking spaz tick. So. His language, like, his, like this whole time, have you seen me write one cuss word? Like, that, this message I'm showing you that I sent was pretty much the only mad message I really sent towards him. And does that look super angry to you? Like, yeah, I was kind of mad. But, I mean, I wasn't cussing, I wasn't insulting him. Like, why, why does he have to do this when I'm trying to just be positive? I said sorry earlier. Like, why? What goes through you guys' heads? I get it's a game. I get, like, your emotions get into it. And, like, you, you get, you're super frustrated. I don't get why he's frustrated. Like, it's my connection. Like, yeah, I'm leggy on his screen, but it's super leggy for me as well. Like, he's not the only one lagging here. Since my internet is bad, I'm the one that's lagging. So, like, none of my bullets connect. I have really bad hit, hit registration. And I still drop 40 and 20. But, like, 40 and 20 isn't even that impressive. But it was better than him, so. Alright, so just to go on that rant. Anyway, he's at 15, 13 at half. You're so trash. Lol just got back out of my lo- or just- just back out of my lobby. 
And yes, I was 15 and 13 on that half. We were playing dom domination on jungle, and I was having a really bad half. I mean, I still went positive though. None of my other teammates were going positive, but besides the point, I could have stepped it up, and I did have a bad half. I ended up taking out the game like 27 and like 16 or something like that. I don't know. Well, that's, I don't think it was that good, but I did have like 27 kills at the end of it, and I, I went positive. Anyway, I said four, 40 and 20 last map, BB. He said, it doesn't matter. You're losing, trash kid. He said, no, he did go 3-0 against me in public matches another l for you bad kid just leave the lobby you're too easy to beat nice zero viewers on your stream loser all right so that is not a fact I actually, I, to be completely honest i only had one other viewer that wasn't me i don't know why i just tried talking my hand right there but i only had one other viewer and it's my mod dragon if you're watching my videos if not then it's all good but I, I did have one other viewer, so it's more than zero. I mean, I know I get it's not like ten. Well, ten's not even a lot. I guess not a thou. I get it's not a thousand. I mean, I did have one viewer in it. Like, it sounds like I'm bragging, but I'm really not. Like, I'm just saying that he's wrong. Anyway, he said, "Thanks for leave capital my like lowercase again lobby." You guys can read it. So. He ended up with that because I did end up leaving, but the reason why I left, because I actually would love playing against him because it was motivating me to do better, and I always wanted to beat him, and every kill I got against him, I got super hyped, so I honestly didn't want to leave, but the reason why I did leave is because I was going to go play with my fr like other friends on Xbox, and we ended up playing Control the whole rest of the night, so as my stream saw, but... Just, like, his attitude this whole video, man, this is Call of Duty people for you, like... This isn't just one specific person, as I, as I showed you earlier, I had other messages. Like, yeah, most of them are towards my connection, and I have been getting all these messages due to connection, but why do we have this negative attitude in Call of Duty? Like, you have kids playing. I know they really, sh well, they should and shouldn't. Like, I played Call of Duty when I was a kid, but I never had a mic, but you have, like, Third, like I played with a 13 year old the night before last night and we've been like there's tons of kids on Call of Duty There's kids on Fortnite, Counter-Strike, there's kids on Destiny and all these communities are super toxic I mean I don't know how toxic Fortnite is, I haven't really played it but I've seen a lot of videos and it's like trolling trash kid and like why why we have this negative attitude man like I'm not trying to be like a saint or anything I just don't see why you have to pick on something like you don't know what their life is, you don't know what they're going through like they could be happy, they could be depressed, they could, there's so many issues that could be happening in them, and then they could just be completely happy, truly happy, and fine, and everything, but again, like, what if you're that one thing that pushes someone over the edge, what if you're that one person that just ruins this guy's whole day, it could be someone's birthday, and then you just go on Xbox and trash him on his birthday, like, come on, use your common sense, don't, like, treat others how you don't want to be treated, I always kind of hated that saying when I was younger, but it's very true, you know? Like, don't, like, if you don't want to be cussed at and stuff, don't do it to other people. Like, it's knowledge, man. It's knowledge. I didn't, as you saw, I didn't cuss him out. And, like, I have no problem with his cussing. I mean, when he called me a loser, that made me kind of sad. I'm not going to lie. But, I mean, I'm kind of fine with this because, like, I get why he's heated and emotional because my internet was bad. He's just trying to wreck kids online. But... I don't see the need for all the hate and stuff, so I just want Call of Duty to be a better community. How can I expect it to grow when we have people like this? And yes, this isn't everyone, so there are lots of good people out there on Call of Duty. There's lots of good people out there on video games and live streams. A lot, a lot of live streams are very positive people. They're good people to look up to, but... And then you have kids like this, or not kids, you have people like this that just like trash like trash the community and I want Call of Duty to grow as much as it can. I want it to be bigger than Fortnite. I want it to be bigger than every game out there. I want, to be, I want it to be bigger than League of Legends on Twitch. Like I'm for sure really passionate about Black Ops 4 and I just want the community to be a positive place and welcoming. Like how you would expect new members to come in? How you expect kids to grow up into Call of Duty as we have? And, like now there's tons of games they can go into and they're choosing Fortnite. Why? This could be one of the reasons why, you know, you don't, like, if I was a parent, and I'd be like, let's say Fortnite doesn't have any people that trash talk and stuff, I'd be like, Fortnite, Call of Duty, which one am I going to let my son play, or son or daughter play? I would go to, like, the one that's less harsh. But, I mean, I'm not a dad, and, like, that's not really a situation that's going to happen. Well, I don't know what the fuck, excuse my language, I don't know what the heck I'm saying, <laughs> but, like, I get the cussing part, but don't cuss the kids. I just kind of did it right there, but I, I'm sorry, YouTube. 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry to all my viewers. I didn't mean to cuss, but I don't know. I just don't see why you have to hate so much. Why you have to be so negative? Like, just like I said earlier, man, treat others how you want to be treated. And I just want Call of Duty to grow. I want the gaming community to grow. Like, video games are a wonderful thing. Yes, you can get addicted to them. I'm probably really addicted to them. But, I don't know, I just want this community just to grow and be better. And we're not doing a really good job of that when we have things like that. So, thank you for watching my video. And I don't mean to, like, expose them or anything. I could have edited his gamer tag out, but I didn't. But, I don't mean to expose them. I honestly don't, I'm not mad at him for doing any of that stuff. I'm mad at him for, for being negative towards Call of Duty. Because like, if it's... It's not just me, he's probably messaging, so I'm, I'm mad at him for doing it to other people. I really couldn't care less that people message me and trash talk. Like, if people are trash talking you, that means they're mad at you because you're playing the game right. Like, someone says you're camping, yeah, who doesn't, you know? Like, you drop 50 kills, someone says you're internet trash. You drop 50 kills, someone says you're fat and live in a basement. Yes, I do live in a va basement, but I'm not that fat, you know? I mean... I hold the camera, oh, whatever, anyway, I gotta wrap this video up, I don't mean to disrespect him at all, I get he's frustrated at me and stuff, but I just don't see the need to be so negative over a video game, like, I for sure get in my emotions a lot, and I get mad at people, I used to, I used to do that, I used to send, like, messages of, like, hate and stuff, and that's why I, like, trying to, like, bring out a video so people can learn off of it and stop it, like, of course it's not going to stop it and not really anyone's going to watch the video. I don't expect that. I just thought I would put out a video just for people who do maybe want to watch it or stuff like that. So that this is your boy ASDZ. Thank you for watching. And uh, I'll be uploading a gameplay when I wake up. So in like what? Like I'll upload a video in probably like 12 hours. Depending on when this one goes up. But I anyway I just wanted to like shed light on that part of Call of Duty. And like the, that part of the community. Like, it is super negative, and I want it to be positive. We want I want to change it so people can want to go and play Call of Duty. Anyway, I've been rambling for 12 minutes now. You guys are probably sick of me, so have a wonderful day or night, whatever time it is you guys are watching this at, and I'll catch you all in the next one.